Hello. Graph from negative one to zero.
exact integral of that expression and so in the second integral we have first 7 over 2 which is the constant term before the integral and then 1 over a where a is the square root of 3 over 4 so we have 1 all over the root of 3 over 4 tan inverse of the linear expression that is being squared at the completed square there all over a which is the square root of 3 over 4 and from there we can first simplify the second term here which looks complicated by having 7 over 2 times 1 all over the root of 3 over 2 and when you have root of 3 over 2 2 cancels this other 2 and then you have 7 over root 3 then inverse of again the root of 3 over 4 gives root 3 over 2 and then dividing you would have that x plus 3 over 2 is multiplied by 2 over root 3. Expanding to a denominator, you then get 2x plus 3 all over the root of 3. And we can now proceed with the substitution of our limits. The upper limit is 0, so we get half ln of 0 squared plus 3 into 0 plus 3 plus 7 over root 3 tan inverse of 2 into 0 plus 3 all over root 3 minus the substitution of the, the lower limit which is negative 1 so we get half ln of negative 1 squared plus 3 into negative 1 plus 3 plus 7 over root 3 tan inverse of 2 into negative 1 plus 3 all over root 3 so we get for uh, the first term here half ln of the absolute value of 3 plus 7 over root 3 tan inverse of 3 all over root 3 minus half ln of 1 minus 3 plus 3 plus 7 over 3 tan inverse of negative 2 plus 3 all over root 3 and simplifying further we get half ln of absolute value of 3 plus 7 over root 3 tan inverse of root 3 when you rationalize the denominator of this fraction minus half ln of the absolute value of 1 plus 7 over root 3 tan inverse of 1 all over root 3 when you simplify this other fraction and from there clearly we can now see that the integral becomes half ln of 3 plus 7 over root 3 into the tan inverse of root 3 which is pi over 3 minus half ln of 1 ln of 1 is 0 so we get minus 0 and then minus 7 over root 3 tan inverse of 1 over root 3 which is 30 degrees being pi over 6 radians and from there we have that half ln of 3 plus 7 root 3 over 3 into pi over 3 minus 7 root 3 over 3 into pi over 6 uh, when you rationalize the denominators of 7 over root 3. So when you proceed to simplify the expressions, when you then find the LCM of the denominators, you will get 18 divided by 2, which gives 9. So the term, the first term becomes 9 ln of 3 plus 18 divided by 9, which gives 2, 2 times 7 pi root 3, which gives plus 14 pi root 3 and then minus 18 divided by 18 which is 1 1 times 7 pi root 3 gives 7 pi root 3 and then simplifying the last two like terms we get 14 pi root 3 minus 7 pi root 3 which gives 7 pi root 3 so that finally we get integral from negative 1 to 0 of x plus 5 all over x squared plus 3 x plus 3 dx as 1 all over 18 into 9 ln of 3 plus 7 pi root 3.